all right guys so let's get into it all right so if you want to do this it's pretty easy you can use your phone or your computer so i'm using my computer for this one so go to your browser get on your browser and then you search for styler ai and then you click on the first link you're going to be asked to create an account so styler is very very like in high demand right now so yeah you see when you get here it might be available for you to sign up or not or you're going to have to wait a couple of minutes because it's just in high demand people use it a lot. People are calling, like you're just using the tool a lot because this is free it's very very free so i have an account already i'm just going to log in and open the home page and so show you guys what's up All right, so this is it. When you open an account, when you sign in with your Google account, this is what you're gonna see. This is the home page. There are so many styles here you can use to create images or convert an image into any of these styles. So create a new project, you gotta click on this. All right, when you click on it, this is the this workspace. Yeah, you, up here you have uh, how to set your dimension. You can title your design here if you like. And here, you see the width and the height. You can decide how you want your canvas to look like. This is the one is to one like for Instagram, or for like youtube short or for normal youtube video type size or you can customize it it's a lot to you so i'm just going to leave it at one is to one and then when you you open this workbook you'll see your credits left so when you create an account a fresh account you're going to have 200 credits okay and it creates four pictures at once per prompt so it's going to be reducing and i think you need to use that 200 credits for like seven days before they renew it for you so you're going to be careful how you're using your credits all right so let's do the first one which is going to be uh text to image so i can click on text to image when i do that i'm going to see different the different styles that we saw in the beginning they are all here so i'm going to decide to use innocent cutie this one and then i'm going to need a prompt so i'm not going to be very descriptive i'm just going to say mohammed salah football player then i'm just going to click on stylerize so this is the style intensity this you can work on to push it up you know or it's all up to you if you want to reduce the style intensity that's cool so i'm just going to leave it at seven and click on stylerize so i'm just going to do everything the default styles the default settings sorry all right guys here we go oh man this is nice <laughs> but it's funny though <laughs> okay so this is what we have so you can select the ones that you know really look like the person they all kind of look like salad so i'm just going to click on the ones i want to keep i'll click on all four of them and then i click on place on canvas here so this is the canvas and these are the layers okay the four pictures are the layers so you, you can create another one if you wish you can just let me just create another one real quick let me do like for your name see so this prompt here you can be very descriptive with the prompt so i just did Mohammed Salah football player. I didn't describe what he was wearing, his hair, and nothing like that. I didn't do that. I just showed you guys how to do it. I'm just trying to show you guys. I'm not using any descriptive prompt. So let me do Lionel Messi. Wow. All right, guys. Here we go. So, like I said, I didn't describe what the player should be wearing and all that. So look at this. <laughs> man this thing is so cute like i wonder how, like how the other styles look like there's so many styles here but anyway so the one that i think best suit you know like what i want i'm just gonna go select select you know and then i'll just place on canvas now let's look at how to save them so to save them what you need to do is click on export here okay when you click on export they're gonna ask you to file type png or jpg that's up to you and then you know these are layers on your canvas all this the, pic the pictures from mosala and four mosala's four misses layers so i'm going to click on export all layers and then export eight pics now do the png and i'm going to save them in my computer so it's downloaded already all right so guys i want to show you guys how you can do image to image so let me just take quickly take a new project i'll go to home and take a new project all right, there we go. Say you have an image and you want to change that image to some like another style. By the way, I just love footballers. So I'm using footballers. You can use any other picture, any other celebrity. So I'm going to go to import images, and then there's, a, there's an image I downloaded, bodybuilder, and I'll open it. All right, so this is it. I'm not even going to try to resize it or none of that. I'm not even touching none of it. So I'm just going to leave it like that. Well, let me say I'm putting this to like. Uh, is this one cool? oh not bad so let's use this i changed this the, the size so let's click on image to image now you're going to need a prompt and style so what style i'm going to use the same innocent cutie okay and then now the prompt i don't have a prompt so what i do is if i can't describe this this little button here that says auto prompt when you click on it when you click on this the ai tool is going to create a prompt that can best describe this for you so i click on it
all right so this is one thing it says a man standing in the gym holding da, 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 da. so one thing is if i click on stylerize i'm going to have different skin colors of of like men in the innocent cutie version so if i want just black uh, versions cartoons to show up i'm going to have to edit this prompt by saying a black man and that's because i just want black cartoon versions okay so so i can best do this and i'm just going to click on stylerize so the ai creates the prompt for me and then now i can just stylerize it all right guys so let's see what we got we got this we got this we got this so this this is like this is like pretty cool look at the real one and then look at the the, the ai 3d cartoon ones this is crazy it's real nice so i'm just i'm keeping all of them man they look good <laughs> i'll place all of them on canvas so you can see the prompt now is well detailed prompt unlike the other ones i just did uh, mo salah and leo messi like i just these are detailed prompts so you can describe like you describe what is i'll keep this prompt in the description anyway so let's just click on place on canvas and this is what we got so this is layer one and the other four layers i can even turn this one off and then using the ideas and icon we go to each layer and then i can say okay i'll export all of these layers image size one x this you can also let me say two times nah man it's okay and then i'll say export all layers export all four pics yeah and then i click on export to download them all right guys so you see that's pretty it that's just like that's just it for this tutorial it's very easy and if you like this video please 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 give it a thumbs up click that like button that you're seeing on the youtube channel so that youtube can recommend these to more people that's how the algorithm work the more the likes the more the recommendation and if you really like to see more of my videos stay tuned subscribe and i'll see you in my next videos bye